So here we'll be uh, forming the 3DS align into a malleable material, which then we can use in the mouth. So I would boil some water. You would then obviously uh, pop the water in. I, I usually would line the, uh, the cup or glass with some paper just so the material doesn't stick. You would then sort of gently dunk the material in and you would wait sort of 15 to 20 seconds until the material is quite soft. Um, obviously, being hot water, you may use the back of a mirror just to make sure it's still quite hard there. Uh, here we go, that looks like it's ready. Now I will grab the material and we'll go to the patient's mouth. And if you have a look here, we have a little slot and we want the upper teeth to go as close to the slot as possible. So now we are going towards the patient. Pop your head back there. So we align the top to the top teeth. So the incisal edge is just at the slot. We then get the patient to bite down into their natural position. Perfect. We then pop our hand behind the patient to support them. And then we mold these little side parts towards the teeth. And we ask the patient to gently hold that position, but not clench. And then we just sort of hold it there until it starts to become hard. And that's locking in their day one position. There will be indentations in the 3DS line. And as I said earlier, we would get the patient to gently bite into it uh, for about five, five minutes or so. And we would wait until that's quite hard. It often takes about 30 seconds to a minute. You may also put some cold water there. Good. That's starting to, and you'd ask, ask the patient, does that feel quite hard now? Good. And just get you to open for me. Perfect. And bite back into it. Perfect. At this point, I would ask the patient to pretend that they've worn the device all night and open for me. Slide your jaw a little bit further forward, just a little bit, and bite down. Now, Patient is biting back into it. Now open again for me, bite a little bit further forward, and no, nope, bite <laughs> forward for me, stop. Now at that point, the patient would realize that they're not biting directly into the appliance. I would have a mirror here at this point so the patient is exactly aware of where natural feels. And just open again and bite back into the indentations there, perfect. And as we take the device out, open for me, you would then show the patient the exact indentations and how to use it. Thank you.